it's summertime and it's hot. And to cool off, we seek that nice summer breeze or we can sit in front of a fan. But have you ever wondered, why does moving air feel cooler than still air? Well, you know what time it is. It's time to get curious. Look, I am your father. Before we talk about the fans and how they work, what we have to understand is temperature. Temperature is the average thermal energy of atoms and molecules. Everything is made up of atoms and those atoms are constantly moving. And the more they move, the more thermal energy they have. So in order for a fan to cool down the air, it has to change how rapidly those molecules move. So does a fan actually cool down the air? The short answer is no. So if the fan doesn't cool down the air, why does it still feel cooler to us? Well, the answer lies within how our bodies regulate temperature. When we get really hot, we get sweaty. And sweat is the liquid that our body produces to help us cool down. So our skin has a lot of thermal energy. And as it produces sweat, the sweat covers that area. The sweat will then carry some of that heat energy away as it evaporates. And that's how our bodies cool down. Now, if you throw a fan or a breeze into the mix, it helps us speed up that process. The airflow hits our skin and carries some of that heat energy away. And then more air comes and carries that energy away as well. So it's a continuous flow and it helps us speed up the process that keeps us cool. And that, my friends, is why a fan or a breeze feels really nice in the summer. Thanks for watching this video and if you liked what you just learned, hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and watch more of my awesome videos about science. And if you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below. And who knows, your question may be featured in a future episode. I'm Komeniti, and thanks for watching. Space is such a dangerous place without any atmospheric pressure, moisture melts off your face.